most beautiful tourism villages in the world, the newest. The United Nations World Tourism Office has announced its third annual list of the world's best tourism villages, which is good news for travelers who take satisfaction in discovering hidden gems. With each site having a unique blend of natural and cultural significance, the UNWTO has been searching the world since 2021 to find the best rural tourist spots. Travelers who favor immersive experiences and serene locations with a hidden away vibe will find the list to be an invaluable resource. 54 new settlements from five continents were added to the growing list this year. With spectacular natural beauties including mountains, seashore cliffs, national parks, and more, all of the locations that made the cut are quaint and old. Check out this closer look at the recent additions that drew our attention. Dordo, India. Dordo is most known for its well-attended four-month festival, Ran Utsit. The town is situated on a massive salt marsh that gave it the nickname, White Desert. In addition to the village showcasing ethnic foods and dancing acts, an intricate and magnificent tent city is built during the celebrations. Activities offered to visitors include yoga, ATV rides, and camel rides through the picturesque salt marsh. Bie, Japan. Bie is one of Japan's dreamiest villages, but despite its magnificent views of flower fields, mountains, and an otherworldly blue glow mineral pond, the UNWTO describes it as a well-kept secret. Travelers can stroll pathways to the numerous flower parks, where rows of vibrant blossoms cover the landscape, or ride around the area's tranquil hills. Take note of the Shiragain Blue Pond, which has a striking cobalt tint due to its rich mineral content, creating a captivating contrast with the surrounding evergreen trees. Morco, Switzerland one of Switzerland's most beautiful places is the village of Morco, which is situated on the glittering Lake Lugano. Similar in style to adjacent Lake Como, Morco is just across the border from Italy and boasts a picturesque town center with Renaissance architecture, as well as ancient houses built directly on the lakeshore. If you're looking for a combination of Italian and Swiss food with breathtaking views, head to one of the town's waterfront restaurants. Coletta Tortel, Chile. The distinctive settlement of Coletta Tortel is situated at the mouth of the Baker River, wedged between Chile's northern and southern ice fields. With most of its buildings situated close to the ocean and connected by nearly 10 miles of boardwalks, the town is entirely car-free. With immersive activities like traditional beekeeping and rowing trips of the misty Blue River flanked by rolling green mountains, local families warmly greet visitors. St. Anton im Arlberg, Austria. This picture-perfect village nestled in an unspoiled area of the Austrian Alps is best described as picturesque. This small community of just 2,400 people, renowned for its unique blend of tradition and modernity, is surrounded by miles of unspoiled wilderness. While many come in the summer to hike or mountain bike through the lush slopes, winter visitors come for the world-class alpine skiing. Tokai, Hungary. This charming village, nestled in the foothills of Hungary's Zemplian Mountains, is well known for its millennium-old custom of producing wine with a golden hue. A patchwork of tiny vineyards and wineries may be found across the region, in addition to the ancient rows of wine cellars with their charming stone entrances set right into the hillsides. Siwa. Egypt Siwa is one of Egypt's most exquisite oases, offering an abundance of breathtaking natural magnificence to behold. The oasis contains a number of bodies of water, the most well-known of which are its picturesque salt lakes, which appear to appear out of nowhere in the middle of the desert. Swimmers can cool off in the vivid turquoise waters that lap against the craggy edge of white salt deposits, or they can explore the adjacent ruins of ancient Egypt, which include the Temple of the Oracle of Amun and the Mountain of the Dead. Aracera, Portugal. Back in the 12th century, Aracera was a typical Portuguese fishing hamlet. Thanks to a variety of good waves that break right off its rocky beach, the seaside hamlet is becoming a well-liked destination for surfers of all skill levels. After spending time at the beach, explore the town's historic district to see its cobblestone streets and traditional homes decorated in the striking white and blue hues. Don't pass up the opportunity to eat seafood specialties like sea urchin, which is commonly found in the waters around Aracera.
Tequile Island, Peru. Tequile, an island in Lake Titicaca that was largely uninhabited until the 1950s, is now well known for its age-old weaving customs, which are instilled in all citizens from an early age as a means of paying tribute to the island's past and ancestors. Visitors can stroll along one of the many paths on the island to enjoy views of the crystal-clear blue lake and far-off mountains. They can also witness traditional terraced farms. Tan Hoa, Vietnam. The Rao Nan River meanders through the lush splendor of Tan Hoa, surrounded by magnificent land formations like limestone mountains and primary forests. Oxalis Adventure, the village's official tour partner, offers cave tours and jungle treks, among other exciting adventures, although the surroundings are peaceful. You might perhaps unwind with a leisurely bike ride around the hamlet and a customary meal served at a local's house. Larici, Italy. This village on the Italian Riviera has a lot of history and subtle glamour. Perched on a rocky point overlooking the rest of the settlement is the medieval stone stronghold known as Castello di Larici. Reminiscent of the more commercialized Cinque Terre are the buildings with vibrant colors, palm trees, and undulating hills that border crystal clear blue waters. Larici is known as Poet's Gulf, since it also holds a number of literary events each year. The annual roster highlights villages that are nurturing rural areas and preserving landscapes, cultural diversity, local values, and culinary traditions. Each village must adhere to nine stringent requirements, which are similar to those for UNESCO World Heritage Sites and include the importance of tourism and environmental and social sustainability. Through this effort, villages who have used tourism as a driver for their own growth and well-being are recognized.